19 patients at a Nashville rehab center have tested positive for COVID-19. And we're learning the center is owned by the same company that owns the Gallatin Center, where 21 patients died from COVID-19 complications. News Force Ryan Breslin live outside of the Treveca Center for Rehab and Healing, where the new cluster, Ryan, is being reported tonight. Yeah, good evening, Tracy. Well, this is the letter that the Treveca Center posted about the situation taking place here. In it, they say they do expect higher numbers of reported cases as a result of the testing. Now, we know that from the Metro Health Department that about 300 people have been tested over the last two days after positive tests came back Tuesday. These numbers coming less than 24 hours after the state health department released nursing home numbers, 375 total confirmed cases, and 37 confirmed deaths among residents and staff across 22 long-term care facilities. The state health department only reporting six cases here in their Wednesday report. The Metro COVID-19 task force leader says they're monitoring this closely. As we reopen, we will face similar isolated incidents. And this is how public health will respond by performing contact tracing quickly and responding immediately to a cluster of positive cases to contain the spread of this virus in our community. And the Treveca Center says that they are continuing to go above and beyond what is recommended to ensure the health and safety of their patients. The governor's office says that they plan to update and release new information regarding long-term facilities tomorrow afternoon. Tom? Ryan Breslin, live for us. Ryan, thanks.